This is way bigger than the high school gym and the VFW and the state fair combined. <laughs> Don't let that bother you. All that matters is the rings the same size. All right, good point, but I assume their rings aren't covered in rust and mysterious stains. Hey, we're working on fixing that. Come on, let's go meet Triple H and uh, try to play it cool. You don't want to recite his entire career history like you did with Matt Bloom. <laughs> <sighs> it wasn't his entire career history. Hey, Hunter, it's been a while. This is my guy that Matt Bloom wanted to bring in for the tryout match tonight. Nice to meet you. You trained him, Baron? I did. He's one of my top students. I'll try not to hold that against him. Look, I've heard a lot of good things, but I want to see you in action tonight before we decide anything. Do you have an opponent for him yet? I do. Surviving in WWE is all about how you handle adversity, so you're going to face the toughest guy we have. Actually, the toughest monster we have. Go introduce yourself to Braun. Don't worry. He won't hurt you. Not until your match, at least. Uh, hey, Braun? I, I just wanted to introduce myself. No autographs. I'm... I'm not a fan. I'm actually your opponent tonight. You mean victim? So how do you want to die tonight? Uh, I'd like to survive tonight, if that's okay with you. What I meant was, in what type of match do you want to get these hands? Uh, tables match could be cool. The owner of our promotion could never afford tables, so we never really got to use them. I can't believe you thought I was actually going to let you choose the type of match tonight. We're going to do what I want to do, because I'm the monster among men. So it'll be a steel cage match. That way you can't run from me. Steel cage. Great idea. That was my second choice. Hey, I've seen some of your indie stuff online. Not bad. I've seen what he's capable of when he was my partner in the Mixed Match Challenge. Based on that, I suggest you start running. Now. Just make the most of your opportunity, win or lose. Matt Bloom brought you in here because he saw something in you. Just go out there and show him that again. Oh, and try to get some free swag. I'd like a... Budio's lunchbox if you're taking requests. What, like a replica title belt? Of course, just trying to keep the mood light. But if you do see a lunchbox lying around,
What are the odds this guy can pull off the upset over Braun? One in a billion? One in a trillion? Wait, yeah, so, so you're telling me there's a chance? I saw this guy pull up in the parking lot today, and he was driving a bug exterminator van. Well, that's appropriate because he's a... About to get squashed by Braun Strowman. Do you guys remember Baron Blade? Apparently he trained this guy. Yeah, I can tell. Have you seen some of this guy's matches on the indies? He's actually pretty good. No, I've got better things to do, like watching puddles evaporate or reading the phone book. Wait, wait, you Dude. still have a phone book? Yeah, remind me to hit you with it on SmackDown tomorrow. One, two. Look at this guy. He looks like deer in the headlights. No, 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 that's the look of someone whose life is flashing before their eyes. You did a good job out there. Really? Feels like I got run over by a big bearded tank. Think it was enough for him to sign me? I don't know. But no matter what, you always have a home in the BCW. Thanks. Hey, I saw a lot of positive things from you tonight. Most importantly, you didn't seem intimidated by being on the bigger stage or by being locked in the cage with a monster. So with that being said, we'd like to offer you an NXT contract. 
look that over and return it at tomorrow night's show. This is amazing. Thank you. I would shake your hand, but I think three of my fingers are dislocated. Don't worry about it. Rest up and we'll finalize everything tomorrow night. You did it. I'm shocked. Me too. I just can't believe it. I mean, against all odds. I know. I'll definitely be sad to see you go. You've become one of my top guys. You'll be fine though, right? I mean, you got Cole and the rest of the crew, yeah? Sorry, what what am I doing? This is your time to celebrate, not to worry about me and BCW. You enjoy the moment. I'm going to go talk to Triple H about when you might start, so maybe I can get you on one more BCW show. We'll do a big farewell match. It'll be great. Sounds good. I, I'll see you back at the hotel. Congrats. I'm, I'm proud of you. Thanks, Baron. Couldn't have done it without you. Thing? Or are you signing with Any WWE? Autograph? Well, actually, I was standing? literally just offered an NXT contract and I can't wait to get started. You should just skip NXT and go straight to the main roster. Actually, you know what? Hey, Triple H, you say listen to your audience? Well, the audience is saying that I'm good enough to go straight to the main roster, which actually I think I proved it tonight by going toe to toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down, but. <laughs> Proved it tonight by going toe to toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down, but. Less than 24 hours after we offer you the opportunity of a lifetime, you get into a fight with a fan outside a WWE event, and there's video. I'd really love to hear this explanation. Look, the fan attacked me first. I was just defending myself. What am I supposed to do, just stand there and get beat up? All we can see is you fighting with a member of the WWE Universe, and that's not good. Well, that's how it happened. You need to understand, this isn't some rinky-dink independent promotion running shows at the Elks Lodge. This is a publicly traded, global company. We can't have our WWE superstars getting into fights with fans, and it will not be tolerated. On top of that, you were bashing NXT, saying you were going straight to the main roster. Who in the hell do you think you are? I was just having fun with the fans. I was just about to say that I would be happy to go to NXT, and the fan attacked me. Oh, I bet. This is what I get for trying to do business with one of your guys, Baron. Come on, Hunter. Can't you just find him or something? No, because I can't find him if he's not on the active roster. I'm rescinding the contract offer. Leave the building, or I will have security escort you out. Don't ever... Bring me one of his guys again. This is on you too. Understood. Remember what I said about making me regret my decision? Congratulations. You did it in record time. Hey, this wasn't your fault. I'm sure we'll figure out something else. Now, come on, grab your stuff. We got to go. Just a minute. Wakey, wakey, Jake the Snakey. <sighs> it is too early for that to be funny. Sorry, I couldn't wait to tell you the good news. <laughs> Triple H called and wants to offer me a contract again? No. Better. What could be better than that? 
Well, after news of your NXT contract being pulled hit the internet, your fan fight video went viral. It's over 2 million views now. Sorry, make that 2.2 million. So a whole lot of people have watched me throw my career away. Why is that a good thing? Because controversy creates cash. My phone's been blowing up. Everyone wants to book you now. You're the hottest thing on the indie scene. And based upon the principle of supply, there's only one of you. And demand, like I said, is high. Your rate is skyrocketing. Okay, okay, this could be good. It could be very good. We can turn chicken crap into chicken salad, if you know what I'm saying. I don't think I get it. You're going to stick it to Triple H and WWE by making your own success in the indies. You'll be way bigger than you ever would have been in NXT or WWE, and we'll do it together. So what do you say? Are you in? I mean, what other choice do I have? I'm in. I'm in. All right. Now, go brush your teeth. Your breath is terrible. It's too early for this. Uh, somebody want to explain to me what's going on here? Give me a minute. Welcome to the new reality of BCW. Because of all your online hype, we sold out our usual allotment of tickets a few days ago. But, since I'm an entrepreneurial genius, I pulled some strings with the school principal, allowing us to move the show outside. Therefore, doubling our capacity. (laughs) All right. All right. Good work. But that's not all. See those fancy video cameras and that nice gentleman I was just speaking with? Uh... Yeah? For the first time ever, BCW will be live streaming our event around the world on pay-per-view. So anyone who's not lucky enough to see Buzz in person can still watch him do his thing from the comfort of their homes for a small but fair fee. Isn't it great? Uh, yeah, it's great. Question, who is Buzz? Oh, (laughs) that's your new nickname. You know, because of all the social media buzz you're generating. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. Buzz? (laughs) It's all turning into chicken salad, my friend. Uh, yeah. Speaking of making things not crappy, have you seen Cole? I feel like I should talk to him before our match tonight. Eh, he's around here somewhere. And, oh, by the way, your match with him tonight is now Falls Count Anywhere. Thought you two could have some fun with all the extra space out here. (laughs) Fun, yeah. You really have an odd definition of the word fun. (laughs) 